Hello everyone, welcome to Uncommon Literature. I am Nadeem Khan. Today I am going to talk about the strategies, how you have to prepare for UGC NET English. So I have also made one video in which I have talked about the best books for UGC NET English Literature. If you have not watched it, I have added the link in the description. You can have a look at it. Moreover, now the exam is approaching. What you have to do that uh, there are some tips which I would just suggest you which helped me a lot in my time. So first the most important I am giving you a, at number one that is go through the previous year question papers. After you are done with your preparation or as much preparation uh, you have covered uh, as many uh, syllabus or ages, no, no problem. You must go through the previous year questions paper of English literature. It will give you a very precise idea of what kind of questions you are going to face. Because when you are studying, you don't have any idea that uh, what sorts of questions will be there. But when you go through the question paper, it gives you a very a clear, clear idea of the questions which you are going to face in the exam. Next point is that it also applies to the paper 1. So for both the papers, you must go through the previous year questions paper and analyze them. Like you just sit and do not copy from anywhere, do not take help from anywhere. Just anal analyze yourself, try to solve it, try to give the answers yourself and then see how many you have been uh, done correct. Next point is that when you are uh, preparing <coughs> for UGC net and the at the last moment like uh, I think the exam is going to happen now so at this moment you must make some notes like the name of the works the major works and their authors and their publication dates as well and the characters usually in uh, what i have seen in ugc net uh, english exam they usually ask uh, a lot of questions we on the basis of characters like this character is from which work it happens with most of the drama of shakespeare so if you uh, are studying uh, shakespeare drama must write down their uh, their characters as well and uh, the date also on which they were first performed and usually what they ask you that usually if you go through any question paper you will find that they usually give you one character's name and they will ask you that uh, from which uh, work this character has been taken okay th these sorts of questions you will have sometimes they also ask you about the publication date of the work so dates of the works the uh, their authors and their characters are very important so you should make their list of all the major ages and all their major uh, authors okay this is applicable only to the major authors only so you can figure out that in every age there's there must be one or two major authors so you you uh, should do this with their works next point is that no matter if you have not been able to prepare 100 percent so give the one exam give one attempt after each attempt you analyze yourself where you stand at present uh, point is that suppose if you have got 40 percent marks and you need around 45 or 50 percent to qualify net exam so now you have to now you have covered 40 percent now you just have to prepare for 10 percent more okay this is the strategy you should follow so now what you already studied that is in, that is with you but now try to study more in more depth in the for the next attempt one more thing do not feel unmotivated if you are not able to qualify net in some uh, some attempts for example two or three attempts if you are not able to qualify do not feel unmotivated i would just suggest you it is a process which takes a little time but you will surely be able to qualify it it uh, very soon if you just go through with all the correct procedures all the correct notes 
okay so this was the point which i just wanted to tell you so these are the three points basically which i have talked about so go through the previous year questions paper and you have to make the notes of each characters with their works with their authors and their dates third point which i told you is that you have to analyze yourself rather than feeling unmotivated you have to analyze yourself after each attempt for suppose you could not qualify the last attempt do not worry do not take uh, any trouble just think how you can uh, prepare more or what what more percentage you have to work for that is the strategy only okay so i believe my uh, advice would be so fruitful for you so with this we have come to the end now thank you so much